Hello, good morning. Well, I've just woken up, had breakfast. It's day one of the experiment. I had a few people around the table sort of posting on Facebook, making Instagram videos. But unfortunately for me, I've had to sort of not partake on my own phone. So uh, I've got a few notifications come through as I've been tagged in a few things, but to leave myself tempted from checking them, I'm gonna delete the apps altogether. This is it, so you probably see about seven notifications there on Facebook. Just gonna delete that now. Oh, delete. Here we go. Removed. I'll just do Twitter now as well. I don't know how tempting that can be. Oh, this is very sad. I'll install. Yes, confirm. Is there another one? Oh, Instagram, that's the other one, isn't it? Oh, and Snapchat as well. I'm so tempted on Snapchat. I might have to just save my story before I do that, but sad times. I'll install. Right. Instagram will be uninstalled. Done. Well, wish me luck. This is day one. I'll try and keep you updated to see how I'm getting on. So I'm just walking back to meet up with the rest of the group. It's only been about five minutes since I've deleted everything, but I uh, just wanted to show you what it was that I could have been uh, documenting. All this lovely views, got the beach in the uh, distance there. Nice little water park guess but no no posting for me wish me luck so I've just returned back to the hotel room after a beautiful day of tanning <laughs> we um usually sort of go in the lobby where it has wi-fi at the night time and we check our phones emails facebook etc um I've just sort of left my friends as I had nothing really to check checked all my emails about twice so I decided to have an early night as it was getting a bit boring not being able to check my usual Instagram or do a snapchat about my day which is very sad um, but I got through day one um, feeling confident hopefully tomorrow I'll uh, be just as good but we got a few trips planned for this week so I might want to document them and I don't know videos will just have to do I guess but <sighs> I'll keep you posted. Oh yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, so, welcome to our live Grammy band night stage. here at Copenhagen Caribbean Bay tonight. Night we're going to take you on a short journey of carnivals throughout the Caribbean. It's history, Amazing. the culture, the splendor, the frenzy of carnival. We're going to try to test as many uh, uh, Caribbean Instagram. countries as Obviously possible. Hard, How many of you have been to the Caribbean before? And enjoy my big All right. Dinner. How many of you have been to St. Lucia before? So it's day three. I'm really upset that I can't document our boat ride today. We're going to be getting on board this lovely boat sailing across the seas down the west coast of the island and I won't be able to document any of it so I'll be taking plenty of videos just to uh, you know monitor the day. I'm very upset about this. So currently me all windswept on a boat. Day four tomorrow, final day of the uh, challenge. Doing quite well. It's been really hard today. I wanted to document the wedding, as you can see, got all the guests there. It's been a really beautiful day. The sun did come out in the end. We had a bit of rain, but we got through it. Um, haven't really thought about being on Facebook, and it's been really weird. We've been sitting, well, everyone else has been sitting on their phones, and I've kind of just sat there and sort of looked around and realised that we really are a society that are on our phones all the time, and it's nice sometimes to just take in the moment so I'm hoping to do that this evening and just focus on enjoying time with the bride who's a long time friend of mine so wish me luck I'll take a few more vids hopefully later on and uh, see you soon one more day to go so there's the bride having a dance with her mom I think she's had a wonderful day it's been really nice to just take it all in and not be on my phone trying to put stuff on snapchat or instagram I think this we can really make me appreciate just taking in those moments but in real time not sort of played back on Facebook a week later on. Though it is good to document memories, it's nice to live in the moments. Right, 
going to get back to the party. Day five, I made it. No social media. I think I'm looking forward to re-downloading all the apps, but it's not something I'm sort of dying to do. Um, it's just been a weird experience. I've had times where I've sat there and looked at everyone and thought, why are they all on their phones and why are they not sort of in the moment talking to me? But it's been interesting to sort of watch them. And it's just been a very interesting week. Um, I guess I'll see how I feel tomorrow, turning it back on, checking through all the notifications. But it's been a really big learning curve. Um, I'm glad I did it and I survived without it. And yeah. Right, so day six, I made it all the way through the week. Um, it's about seven o'clock at night now, so all day I haven't even downloaded my apps, but I'm just in the process of doing it now. So I'll be checking all my notifications and uh, I'll see and let you know what I find. So it's about two days since I finished the challenge back in quite a sunny Birmingham, so it kind of feels like I'm still in the Caribbean. Um, yeah, I've been, I've had internet obviously for the last sort of few days, had Wi Fi at the hotel and then using my uh, internet as I've got back and I haven't really gone on a rampage and posted loads of things. I've kind of made the most of it if I felt like it was a true opportunity to document something but I think I've I've enjoyed sort of seeing what other people have posted and kind of just taking that in more than anything and it's not been something I've been referring to quite a bit. I haven't really been on my phone that, that often um, but I just think over the last sort of seven days I've really just thought it's important to actually live in the moment and I'd much rather leave a place remembering what it was that I saw than what it was I saw through my camera phone or what I posted on Facebook because that disappears it's not something I'm going to scroll back through like a book so I'd rather have the memory in my head and I have more of that now from last week I had a really good time away and I think this was really important to have documented even though it's kind of documenting it through social media but I'm not um but no I think I've learned a lot and I'll be thinking twice before I uh want to post something again but um yeah I'm quite happy with myself and I feel stronger <laughs> so social media hasn't beaten me